Hi, I'm David Powell, Weed Science Technical Manager with Growmark. As most of you already know, dicamba tolerant soybeans were recently granted EU approval. With this advancement, we expect growers to rapidly adopt this technology to help manage their hard to control weeds. One concern with this new technology is the potential for off target movement of dicamba through particle drift or volatility. This brings me to why I'm in this field today. I wanted to share with you some of this research education that Growmark is working on to make sure we properly steward this new technology. The soybean field behind me was planted in a Roundup Ready 2 variety. In a small portion of this field, I sprayed Clarity herbicide. Clarity is the DGA salt formulation of dicamba. This formulation, formulation is less prone to volatilization than Banville, but more likely to volatilize than the improved dicamba formulations that will be recommended with the Roundup Extend soybean system. Let's take a look at this Clarity application behind me and see if we see any volatilization beyond the area that was sprayed. Hopefully, behind my shoulder, you can see that we have a brown area. And on the outside of that brown area, there is no sort of herbicide injury that you can see from the, from by the naked eye. Um, however, if you go down into the canopy up to 20 feet away, you can start to see uh, some pods that are malformed which shows us that the dicamba must have moved at least a small distance away from where it was intended to be applied. So since this isn't the application, this isn't the herbicide that we're expecting to use with our new technology, in our next video I'll show you some of the newer formulations that we're expected to use. So come back tomorrow and uh, see what we have.